Hello and welcome back to the Excel Tip videos. So far in the data validation series, we have learned how helpful and useful this feature is and its uses to avoid any typing errors or mistakes. It not only prevents users from entering incorrect data in the list, but also saves a lot of time. In the previous video of this series, we have learned about dependent drop-down list by using five different techniques with data validation in Excel. And today in this video, we will show you how to prevent duplicate entries in a range using data validation in Excel. So let's see with the help of example that how can we prevent the user from entering duplicate values in the range. All right, as you can see, we have a column C where we have few products and we'll enter more products in that range. We want Excel to prompt us with a message like duplicate product the moment we enter any duplicate entry in the range or this product has already been added to the list so kindly enter another product or in other words we just want the cell to be restricted to have only the unique entries in the range and to prevent duplicate entries in the range we will simply follow three easy steps first we will select the entire column C and then we go to data validations so we press Alt D L to have the data validation dialog box and this time we select custom from allow category as we are going to have function in the formula bar to prevent users from entering duplicate entries. All right. Now we go to formula bar and we type equal to followed by count if function and then we open parenthesis. Now in the first argument we will select the entire column C. So we type it here and then we take C1 as criteria. After that, we close the parenthesis and enter equal to 1. We entered equal to 1 because first count if function will check the number of times that particular entry is included in the validation range. And if it is equal to 1, then the function will proceed and accept the new entry or else it will stop and display a custom error message which we are going to set now. So we skip input message and directly jump on error alert tab. There we will let stop be the error style and then in the title we'll write duplicate or invalid entry. Then in the error message box we type you have entered a product that already exists in this column. So please enter some other sorry product that is unique now we click on ok to complete the data validation as we can see there are already four products in this range we enter product 5 in cell a13 and hit enter the cell accepted the new product without any error because product 5 did not exist anywhere in the range. And now we try to enter product 4 in cell A14. We hit enter. Here we get an error message which we set for duplicate entries. That's because if you look at the range, product 4 already exists in the cell A12. The validation criteria applies to the entire range. So even if we go and enter any duplicate value in cell C1, it will not accept and display the same customized error message which we have set. So it simply means if a user will attempt to enter duplicate value anywhere in the range, it will be rejected and an error message dialog box will pop up. You can click on retry or cancel to clear the error message and enter the unique product code to the list. We click on retry and then we enter here product 6 which is not there in this range. Well this is how you can prevent users from entering duplicate entries in the range using data validation in Excel. If you like this video, don't forget to click on subscribe button and subscribe to our channel for regular updates. Also, please share this video with your friends on Facebook, Twitter and WhatsApp. That's all for now. In the next video of this series, we will explain how to create a searchable drop-down list in Excel without using VBA with data validation in Excel. We hope you found this lesson informative. Stay tuned and keep learning with us. 
Thank you and have a nice day.